we are going to understand about uh, bioaccumulation, bioconcentration and biomagnification. This topic we have to see bioaccumulation, bioconcentration and biomagnification and especially for uh, this term has been utilized for not for degradable substances but it is in a for non-degradable chemical substances and if you will watch it I said that suppose in the water some uh, non-degradable substances has gone and uh, it is eaten by smaller feces, it is eaten by smaller feces and then in each smaller feces 0.1 gram per meter in, in one meter cube there is in a concentration of I said that 0.1 gram per meter cube there is in a particular non-degradable chemical substances 0 0.1, 0 0.1 and there are suppose 100 small feces are there and that of these 100 small feces which has been eaten by so one bigger feces and the one bigger feces has eaten 10 smaller feces therefore 10 into from the each 10 into there is in a from each one there is in a point 1 gram was available this point 1 gram was eaten by I said that uh, this uh, bigger fish has been eaten 10 so therefore 10 into point 1 that become 1 gram per meter cube so there is an again I said that this is an I said that in that animal there is a 1 gram per meter cube is the concentration of I said that non-degradable biochemical substances and further if you are moving that these uh, feces are eaten by this uh, Further, these small feces are eaten by much bigger feces and they are eating five such. So when they are eating five such as so a five into one, this one which has been there, in the, it is available in one form in one meter cube. So I said that five into one, it becomes five gram per meter cube. Further, this five gram per meter cube available in the bigger fish and this figure fish was eaten by the uh, human being and all said the one human being has eaten suppose two feces then then available bio concentration I said that it is in the form of non biodegradable substances 5 gram per meter cube it will be eaten two so it will convert into 10 gram per meter cube because he has eaten two so there's there will be in the human being finally we are able to say that the bio concentration of the non degradable chemical substance is 10 gram per meter cube but when it is I said that again I said in the first uh, I said that food chain there is an I said it was 0.1 gram per meter cube in the first food chain it is a 0.1 gram per meter cube when the non-degradable non-degradable bio uh, non-degradable chemical substance entered it is known as bioaccumulation it is known as that the first time in the food chain any non-biodegradable substance enter it is known as a bio accumulation and thereafter this much of the feces are eaten by another feces and here the bio uh, co concentration is I said that one gram and then another food chain there is an I said that in the another species of this food chain is there a five gram per meter cube and this uh, 10 gram per meter cube so these are known as what each at every species of the food chain will have the bio concentration is known as a bio concentrated the amount of non biodegradable substance concentrated it is known as bio concentration I said that this piece I said that this species I said there is an species 1, species 2, species 3. The species 1 bio concentration is I said that 0.1 gram, species 2 bio concentration is 1 gram per meter cube and the species 3 it is bio concentration I said that it is 5 gram per meter cube and human being species 4 it is I said that bio concentration 10 gram per meter cube. So this is the bio concentration at each every level of the food chain but in the first level of food chain when the bio concentration enter in the form of non biodegradable substance it is known as I said that bio accumulation but in the different species of the food chain of level bio uh, non biodegradable biodegradable substances known as I said that bio concentration but if you can see that this bio concentration this bio concentration in the food chain keep on increasing keep on increasing from 0.1 to 1 gram then 5 gram then 10 gram and that is known as biomagnification that is known as biomagnification again I said that entries in the first food chain first species of the food chain that is known as bioaccumulation and it is available in the form of I said that bioconcentration at every species it is known as bioconcentration non degradable substances and then because you have been able to see in the food chain it is keep on increasing it is known as biomagnification such things we have been able to see that in the Japan through the industries we have been able to see the mercury which has been entered into the sea and through the methane it has been reacted it forms methyl mercury and the methyl mercury was eaten by I said that feces and then it is a first it is eaten then it is become a bioaccumulation further it is increasing 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 we can be able to say bio concentration bio concentration it is becoming and finally it is eaten by the human being so it is known as a bio concentration of each food chain and finally it is eaten by the human being so we can be able to see bio magnification 
cost interest bioaccumulation and at every level what is concentration is there it is known as bioconcentration at each every level and it is done by human being and the human being is facing one problem for by the mercury when it is known as the minamata m for mercury m for minamata the kind of disease the japanese people has been faced and then i said that similarly cadmium is causing it i tai so m for mercury m for mina minamata and then cadmium i said that koi kaat lega to log bolenge tai 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 and then chai tai tai itching karenge there is a kind of itching problem and then pain problem it is known as so kaatne se pain hota hai kaatne se pain hota hai cadmium pain cadmium pain और लोग ताई ताई चिल्लाते हैं देन आई सेड दैट वी कैन बी एबल टू सी कैडमियम इट इज आई सेड दैट इटाई इटाई एंड एम फॉर मर्करी एम फॉर मीनामाटा एंड देयर आफ्टर वी हैव बीन एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड बायो एक्यूमुलेशन बायो कंसंट्रेशन एंड बायो मैग्नीफिकेशन